Hey guys, do you want to know how to make a texture view model just like this? Well, today, I'll show you. So guys, before we start this build, just a quick mention that the second part of this series, the view modeling series, will be about um, the like holding the weapon, the pistol, um, with um, your view model, you know, with your hands um that's gonna be the second part i am that's gonna do with all animations with the gun and everything okay so that's the second part so now let's get into this build so the first thing we're gonna do is we're going to add the view model of course so let's add a model and and let's call this model character visual and then let's add the humanoid so we're going to add a uh, thing here just called for now we're just gonna put this model here called weapons um this is just here just to show you where the the weapon is gonna be but uh that's for the second video um but now we are going to add a another we're gonna add a part okay we're also going to add a shirt so we can get the texture I right. so we're gonna put shirt okay and let's just take this part and i'm gonna make the size just one comma one comma one yeah i think that's a pretty good size and then we're gonna make the transparency one and uh let's just Actually, no, I'm going to keep this just maybe above a little bit just so I can see the arms and everything. All right. And we're going to call this just root. All right. And we're also going to make it the uh, primary part. So make the root, the, the thing that we named root, the primary part. And then after that. I we're going to uh, go to character. Oh no, we're not gonna go to animation editor. We're gonna go to rig builder, and we're going to just click on blocky avatar. Okay. And now we're going to take um, left hand, left lower arm, and left upper arm. We're gonna put that in here. And then we're going to also take the right, uh, the right lower arm and the right upper arm. Okay, and we're going to put this here as well. Okay, um, and then uh, what we're going to do is just delete this rig. Um, and we're going to go into the right upper arm. Okay, guys, uh, don't delete the rig before you do anything. Um, because then that'll delete the right shoulder. I right, just press Control Z, um, and just go in it, go in the right shoulder, and it'll say upper torso because it's trying to connect to this one. But we don't want it to connect to this one, okay? We want it to connect to this one instead, root. And then we're going to go to the left upper arm as well and do the same thing. Um, then yeah, and then we just do the same. Thing. And there we go. I now like they're both connected to this part, and now we're pretty much good. I so now uh, we're gonna go uh, down here. Well, actually, we're gonna make a folder in Replicate Storage. I wanna call it uh, View Models, and then we're just gonna put that in there. Um, and then we're going to go into starter player and we're going to add a local script into starter character scripts. Um, and what we're going to do, we're going to call this character, character, oh, I character, first person visual okay and 
we're going to um well actually um go down in the description and you will find uh the code for this video i'm gonna copy the code on the website okay guys now that you have copied i uh so now um actually yeah so this is already done for you i think uh, let's let's actually test the game now let's see if this works um actually um let's put uh let's go to starter player and let's uh put lock first person okay so it locks on first person when you join the game okay now i'm locked on first person okay wait okay for some okay i right, so it seems like it didn't work but i don't know why let's see uh if we have any errors uh texture is not a oh yeah okay well yeah uh yeah let me fix that so guys um it looks for a texture character but it's not called texture character you could call it texture character but it is not called texture character um for you guys i think i probably changed it uh and everything's good but for me it's not good so let me just change that to character visual and i think yeah now it should work perfectly right yeah okay okay whoa okay why can't okay yeah there's definitely something wrong okay um wait let me just uh stop the game oh yeah we didn't anchor it we didn't anchor um anything yeah actually not anchored i mean we just can't collide so let's uh not make anything can collide and also the root is also can't collide and it's not anchored so um make that anchored so make the root anchored and then make all of these well make the root also not can't collide but everything else should be just not anchored and not can't collide so let's see if this works okay it seems like well i can't oh there you go now i can move i yeah it, it works actually uh, but the thing is, one thing I forgot to tell you guys is that um, the animation, the Ido animation might, well, also both animations, Ido animation and the animation, might not uh, work for you. Uh, just use, uh, make your own animation, and I'll show you right now on how to do that. I, uh, so let me just show you guys. Like, so, uh, take out your character visual, okay? and after you do that, um, go to, you know, the avatar, and then go to animation editor, and then do that, click on your, uh, character visual, and then make this, I don't know, uh, basically, yeah, I think, I'm just gonna call this, like, run, anim um so what i'm gonna do is yeah well i already have it done for myself but i'm just gonna show you guys how you could make your animation so you could just do what i had before if you want uh what i did was just move these two hands up and then put them to each other you could also turn them around just to give a little more human like type of hands because so you could just put this one like let's twist it a little bit too much um you could put like one on top of the other and that's how i made mine um definitely make yeah no actually no that's actually pretty good and then i just copied these keyframes put them over there and then in the middle i would just um do this it's going to go more to that side so just push it there and then we'll also repeat it and then that's how i made my walk animation um but also you could also try making it more closer because um sometimes it's just too slow okay that one's too fast i mean uh, however you like it um and yeah that's basically how you make the animation and then 
uh, all you do is go to three lines, publish. You could set the animation proximity, but I don't think you have to touch this. Um, uh, but yeah, and then in well, not import, uh, publish to Roblox, and then it would pop up this. Put you know, I don't know, like run animation here, description, and then put animation, and then put you or a group. Um, you would like to put it as but I already have one so I'm gonna discard this um, and now I'm gonna put this back in here one thing I am noticing when I go in the game is okay it shows my hand shows my hands but it doesn't put the texture for my character on the thing which is kind of weird, but I think I know why. Oh wait, I think I know why. Wait. Let me go into here. So yeah, the view model is this. I then it does. Yeah, shirt. That template. template. That shirt template. Shirt template those characters. This is. Oh my hell. god, bro. Oh, hell. And then I also. Hell. Like, oh. So wait, wait. So if I play the game. I play the game and the arm show up. It's in the camera. It has the body colors. Okay, so. And it also has the humanoid. Oh, but it's R6. Yeah, wait, why? <laughs> Is that the problem? That might be the problem, but. Oh, that was the problem. Okay. Well, that was the problem okay so guys it did work um but i'm actually gonna adjust the code right now for you guys um because that is weird so i'm gonna just all i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go here um i'm gonna get so i got the characters humanoid so what i'm gonna do is do new model dot humanoid dot um rig type equals humanoid dot rig type all right there you go guys i mean i just did the code a little bit it probably is already done for you guys so i'm just see apping a bunch and it's already done for you guys but um yeah it works for me yay um so yeah, th th that's the end of this video. But the next video is about, um, yeah, the next video is about on how to, you know, actually put a gun on the hand and it actually does like an animation, like the gun animations for the character. So if you guys uh, want to see that, um, just uh, wait until the outro comes in. So I'll... See you in the next video. Bye-bye.